Today we will learn all about actor tags and actor component tags and why you could use them. We will not cover gameplay tags as that is another can of worms that we will cover for another video. A tag is a text identifier which you can use for an actor or actor component. You can add a tag on the details tab when selecting an actor. Know that you should look underneath actor and not component. Otherwise you will add an actor component tag. Yeah, no, it's a bit confusing but you will get used to it. You can also add it at runtime like this. You can use this for example if you want all the spawn points points with the tag guns, keeping it separate from the spawn points with the tag pickup. More information on this example can be found in my item spawner video. You can also use this for a door that you only want to open for the players on the yellow team. Therefore you can use the node actor hashtag. Actor components have their own separate tag system which works the same way. The only difference is that it needs a reference to the parent actor which owns the actor component and which type of component you're looking for. I haven't really found a use for this. Maybe to differentiate your left gun from your right gun? Anyway, let me know in the comments down below if you have used this before.